What's up guys, welcome back to a new video. I hope you are having a great day and I really appreciate you clicking on today's video. As you guys can see, we're in a new little setup. I started making this corner of my room into a little studio so I could start getting back into music and to have a cool little background for the videos. I wanna improve the quality of these videos and this is the first step. If you guys like the new little setup, go ahead and drop me one of these down there. And while you're at it, subscribe and turn on post notifications. I'm on a roll right now, uploading videos either Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. This video is going to be uploaded just a bit late, but I'm on a roll, guys. And you guys do not want to miss any of the future videos that I will upload. In today's video, I will tell you guys about five mods so you guys can rice out your buckets. <laughs> If you're like me, you're all about those little mods that just add all that extra spice at a very affordable price of under $50. If that interests you, stay tuned for the rest of this video. Before we get started guys, like all those Amazon mods that you always see, I know you be searching those mods up because you always just want to rice out your car, you freaking ricer. Before we get started, I do want to mention that I'm not going to recommend you using all of these mods at the same time. You do not want to be that guy that pulls up to the meads with all these Amazon mods thinking that your car is the baddest in the parking lot when it's really just an Amazon rice bucket. That is my little disclaimer before we get started with the video. Let's get started with mod number one. The first mod I would like to recommend to you guys is a hardware kit. With a hardware kit, you really can't go wrong and it brings in the best bang for your buck. They range from 10 to $20 depending which pack or how many you want, so the price could vary, but they are honestly really cheap. On Amazon, they have a huge variety of colors and honestly, you can find the perfect one for you. Whatever theme you are going for, Amazon has your back. One of the best ways to complement your engine bay is by putting in a new set of hardware. If you have mix match bolts or if you have rusty bolts, go ahead and swap those bad boys out. Put these in and bam, your engine bay is going to look way better. It's all in the little details and honestly, the hardware is something that I recommend highly. I know that it doesn't look as good because the engine bay is all dirty, but one of the future things is that I'm gonna clean up this engine bay. I'm gonna make it look way better so that the bolts can complement it and the engine bay can complement the bolts. The next one I would like to recommend to you guys, I really don't know how to pronounce it, but I imagine it is pronounced Tsurikawa. And it is one of these. I'm pretty sure if you have seen any of these JDM cars, you would notice that they usually have those little hanging things with an emblem on their door handle or the little handle that's on the roof. And it's pretty much just one of those. So if you guys wanna pick some up on Amazon, they range from anywhere to 10 to 30 to 40, depending how many you want. On Amazon, they sell you packs of one, packs of one, packs of two, packs of four, packs of 20 even. And they honestly have a huge variety of different emblems and colors, and you could really have fun with this. It's really a cool mod. Not really going on the hatches because it doesn't match the color weight, but I have another car where it will go on, and I highly recommend this if you like that JDM style. This is the way to go for your car. The next mod I would like to recommend to you guys is Headlight Vinyl. With Headlight Vinyl, it's just one of those things that I really like. I like to change up the colors of my headlights. It is illegal, which is my precaution to you guys. If you guys don't want to get into any trouble, do not add a Headlight Vinyl to your headlights. You can instead opt out to try to add into your fog lights. My car does not have fog lights, so I would just add it onto the headlight. They are really cheap. I guess they vary between yards and they range from 20 to $40, depending what colors, how many you want, and the brand. They have different brands on there. I don't recommend any just because it's Amazon. If you guys want to get it professionally done, take it to a shop. But if you guys like to tinker with your car, this is the way to go. They have tons of colors and you can really have fun with this and express yourself with your headlight vinyl. I've been talking about all these other mods with expressing yourself, but enough with the mushy stuff. Let's talk about window visors. With window visors, with window visors, I recommend them if you want to add a little more sporty look to your car. Window visors are one of those mods that you can throw on a Kia, on a Corolla, on a CRV, and it makes them look so sick. It makes them look a little bit more sleek, a little bit more sporty. You look like swords on top of your windows, and it's honestly super easy to install. You just take off the 3M strip on the back, stick it onto the weather strip on top of your window, and bam, easy like that, you're welcome. <laughs> said that I didn't film the mods in any specific order I lied and I left these for last 
This is the door light and it's honestly the sickest mod on this list. If there's any mod that I would recommend more, it is this one. This one, I guarantee you, will pull all the women. Forget about your forget about your rims, forget about your coilovers, forget about your carbon fiber. They don't care about that. They don't care about how loud your car is. But as soon as you pop this door open. <laughs> you're welcome. They range from $10 to $20. You could really just find whatever is best for you. And it's super easy to install. No wiring. I hate wiring. And as soon as you open it, bam, she's yours. And that's it. You're just going to run off with some pretty cool mods that honestly cost less than $50. <laughs> up today's video guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video i certainly had a little bit of fun filming it and i hope you enjoy all these mods they're super cheap and affordable really easy to install it and they add a lot of a lot of value to your car as long as you're choosing the right ones i hope you guys can enjoy today's video do me a favor drop a like subscribe turn on post notifications so you guys are notified every single video and like always guys god bless you and i'll see you guys in the next video